Greetings again, fair Vivian. It's been such a relatively long time since we saw each other last. I've never seen you before in my life. Tell me who you are and when we met. There's no time. Athelred the Alchemist is waiting for your help. Very well, but please don't go anywhere. I would really like to talk with you. Well, I can't make any promises. I'm old now and likely to forget to wait for you. Milady, you've come. I am Athelred, alchemist in the service of King Offa of Mercia. There's talk of a conspiracy to murder the king. This would be very bad for the country. If you will find enough evidence to identify the would-be murderer, I'll give you the magical ring you seek.
Well, Ethelred, I have determined which bottle of wine has been poisoned. Excellent! And I know who gave the bottle to King Ulfa. With this evidence, we can arrest the culprits. King Ulfa lives another day because of you. I hope the magic ring will help you in your quest. No, Alchemist. Give me the ring. Don't make me hurt you, please. Oh, forget it, mister. You've got some answering to do. You have no idea what's at stake. Vivian, watch out! Thanks, Paul. I don't know what you did, but it worked. I owe you one. Ah, he got away, but thankfully he didn't get the ring. Fare thee well, Vivian, and good luck. That man is clearly insane and possibly violent. He'll stop at nothing to get the rings. Your inheritance, the Ambrose legacy, is in your hands, Vivian. Is that supposed to make me feel better, Ball? I don't even know where to look for the next ring. Lucky for us, I think I recognize the old woman you met. Yeah, for the second time, if you ask her. But she did know my name. I believe she is Ostrid the Witch, your grandmother. I take it there's a lot of greats in front of that. 
How clever you are, dear. She lived in the 7th century. Then let's fire up the Nexus machine. There's no time to lose. <laughs>